Now, this is a game I have been looking forward to ever since I saw Mr. Septicai himself play it in VR. But I'm not a rich boy, I'm a corrected little poor boy. I can't afford VR, so I've waited till it comes to console. But for those of you who don't know, this is a game called Trover Saves the Universe. And as you can see there, created by Justin Roiland. Now some of you are thinking, I know that name. And you do. <laughs> it is the creator of Rick and Morty. Oh, here we go. This little shampoo game contains naughty words that may not be suitable for ears that are attached to a child's head. Oh no, we're going for a chore. Oh, cute doggies! Cute little doggies! Look at him, they're so cute! Uh oh. Oh, there they are. Oh, I'll be taking these. <laughs> you stupid piece what? of shit! <laughs> what the hell is happening? <laughs> you stupid piece of shit. <laughs> well, that happened. We now return to as the chair turns. <laughs> Why don't you ever rotate your chair, Samantha? All I ever asked of you is that you rotate your chair. I don't like rotating my chair. If you want this marriage to work, you'll rotate your chair, goddammit. Just use the right thumbstick and, and rotate your chair, Samantha. Yes, I know how to rotate, Reginald. I'm not an idiot. I know all I have to do is move the right thumbstick to the right or left to rotate my chair. I still refuse. Oh, look at the little dog things! Looking at them and pressing the interaction button, like the uh. things on the on the ground or the things on the desk, Reginald. Why, why, why won't you look at the things on your desk or the ground with the mess by them and pressing the interaction button? Hmm? Just forget it, Samantha. We don't have time for this right now. The big staring contest is tonight. We need to practice if we expect to win. Yes. You Play with right. the ball. For once, Reginald. Yes, okay. Staring contest. No one talks. First person to blink loses. Starting right now. Are we starting? Do you just... Okay. One, two, three, two, one. Starting now. What is happening? You have four messages. Message one. <sighs> Jeff, call me back. End of message. Message two. Your lawyer here. Not looking good, I'm afraid. Because the dogs are yours and because they seem to be powering this monster, you may be liable. Call me. End of message. Message three. Hey, asswipe! Your rent is due! This isn't a charity! End of message. Message four. Hey, it's Mom. I never did like those dogs of yours. I'm not surprised, to be honest. I mean, now they're powering that big old beak monster. Sweetie, it's a big mess. Anyways, call me back. End of message. Well, okay. Hey, hey open up! Come on, here, look at, look at me there. It hey, looks like up. Mr. Poo Poo Butthole. Oh. Come on, open up! Who the hell is this? Oh, God. Oh, yeah. This is definitely the right place. You're the one. Okay, listen to me. We don't have time to get into it right now, but you're coming with me. We interrupt this program for an important breaking news. A giant beak monster, you heard that right. A motherfucking giant beak monster has destroyed the science center, damn near half the city, stolen science equipment, microscopes, beakers, I'm talking about flames. Things are really crazy right now. Shit's all fucked up, and this goddamn beak monster has dogs that are plucked into its eyes, and they are powering him up above any power level I have ever seen. And he's scaring people, my grandmother's afraid. All right, back to your regular schedule program. Man, you really, you, your dogs. You have no idea how fucked things are because of your two stupid dogs. Hey! Uh. Ew! This is a power baby. You're gonna be seeing a lot of these throughout the whole game. I mean, I really love them. I got them in my eyeballs, you know? In my eye holes, I mean. So just here, look at this one that I just pulled out of my eye and, and it'll come to you. Just look at it and it'll come to you. Ew! Alright, listen, you're gonna control me, man. Because I'm tired, okay? I, you know how long it took me to find you? I'm exhausted. 
<laughs> All right, and that's how we do it. Let's go. Oh, it's such a weird control. You know, it took me forever to find you. Looked all over the place. Thank God, I'm gonna dump your ass off at my boss. I'm gonna get my space money. Then I'm gonna go to this place in my home world where I get all crazy messed up called empty peepers. But what do you know about that? You're just a dirty chair orpian. <laughs> chair orpian. We interrupt this program for an important breaking news. The beaked monster with dogs in its eyes has attacked again, this time robbing the Cherorpian Science Center of valuable cloning equipment. Sally Chair is live on the scene. Thanks, Chuck. The two white fluffy dogs that seemed to power the beaked monster were crying today as the beaked monster broke into the Cherorpian Science Center and effortlessly made off with valuable cloning equipment. Let's talk to the Science Center manager, or whatever his title is, and get his thoughts on this. This never would have happened if that idiot hadn't have brought those two dogs into our city. Chair Orpia is no place for creatures like that. They have four legs, they walk, they refuse to sit in chairs, but we still allowed them to stay. And now this, my cloning equipment. Fuck this, fuck this bullshit. Fuck, shit, ass, fuck. Um, oh, oh my, oh, um, back to you in the studio, Chuck. Ahem, ahem, sorry about that, folks. Clearly... Lots of outrage over these dogs and this beaked monster. Uh, in other news, the chair fair is here, and this year everything's on a stick. We got chairs on a stick, we got armchair rests on a stick, Bobby Joe's on the scene live. Hey, what's up? I'm Bobby Joe. I'm at the big chair fair. This shit's fucking crazy this year. We got shit all on sticks here. This is fucking wild. Good thing that, um... Giant beak monster isn't harassing us over here because it's lovely day out, and there's no trouble whatsoever. What the hell is happening here today? No giant beak monster here. He only was at the cloning place that has all the cloning equipment. Oh boy, look, there's more things on sticks. We got little tiny cars on sticks. We got babies on sticks. Do you guys have strict huh? homeowners association guidelines, or, or are you a bunch of whoa, fucking whoa, holy whoa. shit? Woo <laughs> woo. Oh, well, look who it is. I'm locking you here and making a citizen's arrest. Do you not think I don't know who you are, huh? Shake your head, yes or no. Answer me. No? Well, you're wrong. I do know who you are. You're the Cheropian with the dogs. Those dogs are in the eyes of that big monster, and it is fucking everything up now because your dogs gave them some kind of superpowers. So we have you to blame for this bullshit that we're going through right now. Do you feel sorry for what you've done? Answer me, yes or no. Do you feel any remorse? You're a heartless monster. It's bad enough <laughs> you have two dogs. Now you're hanging out with a purple walk person. It's unchair like, you know. It's uh, he looks more like a me seat. Man, I don't have time for this bullshit. I got a motherfucking sword. You threaten me, boy? I ain't for you. Come. Oh, fuck Ow. you, old man. Fuck <laughs> him up, Jova. I'm gonna feel this tomorrow. I'll turn on the nose. Ah, just stop hitting me. <laughs> I turned on your warp node. Don't hurt me no more with the knife. Haha, <laughs> you fucking coward. You run, that's right. You run away from me. You criminal. Man, I cowards. normally don't get like that, but. <laughs> you fucking cowards, that's right, bitch. Man, that guy's run an away, asshole. bitch. Haha, <laughs> you fucking cowards. That's right, bitch. Run away from me, you criminal coward. That's it, Trevor. Come here and let's fuck him up. Hitting an old man, you fucking cowards. Haha. <laughs> oh, yeah, old man, you really want to Uncle. Uncle. Hey, it's elderly abuse time. Ow. You're, a, you're, a, you're an idiot. I'm gonna die, you oh, man, me. okay, we're really gonna do this. Huh? Gonna, let's go for it. Shit. Let's kill this motherfucker. <laughs> Shit, this is the science building we saw on the news. Look at all the stuff I got. Yeah, yeah, I got stuff too. Hey, what oh, is God, it's Rick. I don't know, but it's ours now. Hey, look, there's I'll somebody we can beat up. Oh, yeah. I'm not. Oh, I'm not with that person. Hey, come here. We're gonna kick your ass. Who the hell are these guys? Uh, I guess you know. You killed my friend. Huh. <laughs> that's that. Top secret and science shit. I love it. All right, come on, let's go to the telepod. It's back the other way. Fucking finally, we're at the telepod. This is the telepod. So telepods are, are, are how we get around, okay? That's how we Ew. travel in the cosmos. They teleport us to where we'd like to go. So we're gonna use it to go to my boss's office so I can drop your ass off, your stupid ass off, and get my space money and get the hell out of here, you know what I mean? And go live my life. Go ahead and hit the button to uh, teleport us to my boss's office. And 
that's when I woke up and realized she was dead. Oh, Trover. Okay, but I'm, I'm sorry. sorry. It took me so, so long, but here's the chair Orpian uh, in mint condition. So I'll take my space money and be on my way. Thank you very much. Actually, Trover, some things have changed since we've last talked. I'm going to need you to stay partners with the chair Orpian. Your job's not over yet. Come on. You said all I had to do was find the stupid chair Orpian and bring them to you. And then, then I get my space money. Trover, shut the fuck up. I have the abstainers on the hollow dish phone. We are the abstainers. Holy shit, that's what the abstainers look like? They look just like the, the guy who's got the dogs in his eyes causing all this trouble. Shut the fuck up, Trover. No one needs to hear your commentary about everything. The abstainers would like to talk with the chair Orpian. It is true that we look like Gorkon. He was one of us. We were four, but he has broken free. Chair Orpian, is it true you were the owner of the dogs that power Glorcon? Yeah, it's definitely the right Chair Orpian. You should have seen, seen their apartment. We're not talking to you, shitbag. We're talking to the Chair Orpian. Oh, so what Trover is saying is true. You are the owner of the dogs. I told you guys. We need to meet this Chair Orpian face to face. You must come to our home world, our inner sanctum. Wow, whoa, you're in the inner sanctum void, wow. Nobody's ever been to the Abstainer's Inner Sanctum. Oh, mama. This is going to be, that's going to be quite a, a little deluxe travel package. How does somebody even get to the Abstainer's Inner Sanctum? You must find the Crystal of Ithacles. It is located in a place called Schleamy World. Oh, oh, I know where Schleamy World is. All right, okay. All right, Trover. Now, I'm sure you can see better as to why you, I needed you to stick around. We need you to protect this Chair Orpian. You and the Chair Orpian are a team. You're partners now. You're together. You're you, you're gonna need to go get that fucking crystal in from Schleamy World so that you can meet the abstainers face to face. Once you retrieve the crystal of Ithacles, you can plug it into the telepod. It will give you access to our inner sanctum. We must meet this Chair Orpian in person. It's of the utmost importance. Okay, all right, we got it. Jesus, Chair Orpian, uh, go ahead and hit the button on the telepod there. Uh, to teleport to Schleamy World. Yeah, Jesus Christ, man. Schleamy World. Bullshit. Trover, I don't want to hear any bullshit from you. Fuck you. Yeah, all right, okay. You should have fucking let me know that this was po a possibility. I don't like surprises. Trover, there are higher things at stake here than, than that right now. So quit being a little baby and do as I ask. I'm your boss. Oh. Jesus, man. Jesus fucking. That guy's a fucking asshole. Man, I didn't I didn't sign up for this shit, you know? And now the abstainers are involved. Fuck, man. The, the, the abstainers, man. Imagine every time you've jerked off, they, they've seen it. Every time you, you... They watch... They know... They literally can describe to the minors detail every time you've taken a shit. They know every single moment. They know everything. They've seen everything. I don't like them. I don't... I, I don't... I, I, they make me uncomfortable. The abstainers. Well, it's obvious that Trover doesn't like the abstainers. Let's go, Trover. Da, 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 da. Hey, 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 look at me. Hey, hey, look at me. Ah, who are you? Pop up and I need your help. All right, who, who is this guy? I told you I'm Mr. Pop up. I called a number. I, I don't know who I called. They're just supposed to come and help me. All right, well, it's not us. Now, no, leave. Now, fuck off. There's a man named Michael <laughs> and he built a house on the bluff and and that's not zoned for residential usage. It's zoned for public use and I'm very upset about it. We don't know what the fuck you're talking about, dude. It's got nothing to do with us. We got our own shit to deal with, all right? You gotta help me out. I can't do anything. This guy, Michael, he's a total asshole. He's, he's treated me like shit my whole life. Good, now go away. <laughs> oh, bad. He thinks he's hot shit and can do whatever he wants. It's not fair sitting up there in his, in his red house. I would have built my house up there, but I didn't because I know how to follow the rules. You're disgusting. You're naked. Go away. I know you guys will help me if I just go. Oh, ow. I'm floating up here now. You can't hit me up here. If I just keep at it, the squeaky wheel gets the grease. That's what my mom taught me as a baby. If I kept crying, she would eventually give me more nipple milk. I learned that at a very young age. If I'm really loud and abrasive and complain, I'll eventually get what I want. I'm gonna rip that little band-aid that's covering up whatever's under there and put it on your mouth. I'm sorry you don't like me. Go away! I, I really am. But I need your help, and, and you're the only people here. Go away! If you just help me, then I'll go away. Otherwise, you're just going to have help. What the fuck, asshole? 
So if you just help me, then I'll go away. Otherwise, you're just going to have to deal with it. I'm Mr. Pop-Up, and I got no one else to, to turn to. <coughs> Are you mentally handicapped? What's wrong with you? Do you know what bothers me the most about Michael? His inability to listen. Do you hear yourself right now? Did I mention Michael Mast... <coughs> Hold on, I'm choking on something here. I'll be right back. What the hell happened? Shit, there's a bunch of little gremlins over there. They just killed me. Y you see the hearts on, on, on your controller? When those go down to zero, I die. And if you find any red power babies, those things will give me health. The more important thing is we focus on finding the crystal of Ithacles. Oh, looking for the crystal of Ithacles, huh? Well, I have the crystal of Ithacles right here. I'm the one who has the crystal. Big surprise, big reveal. Holy shit, how did you get that? The abstainers gave it to me like 50 years ago to hold on to. You guys want it? You guys need this? Of all the people that have it, yes. We need it, please. Okay, well now you have to do what I say. Get that guy Michael off. Where did he off. just put it? I'll help you out. You're gonna need a chair upgrade because you can't even see over this log. So I'm gonna give you a chair upgrade. Here it comes. Your chair upgrade. <laughs> hey, what the hell, you lunatic? You just spit all over the chair. No, no, no. I, I just gave him a chair upgrade. It's it's how we do things around here. I, we spit. Pop up with me. It's your new magical chair upgrade. What? Okay, good. Okay, good. Do you see the house? Use your blinky blinksters and look at it. It's way back there. You have to see it. Don't you see it? Where? It's the house with smoke coming out of the chimney. Jesus, have you have you never seen a house before? It's okay. Oh. Wait, that's Michael's house. That's the house I need you to destroy. Now don't forget, pop up or down if you need a better vantage point. Don't be stupid. Don't be a jerk. Use the pop-up ability often. Without it, you're screwed. Missing a hard jump? Pop up. Can't see where to go next? Pop up or down? I'll be back soon. Now, go get rid of that goddamn house and the crystal is yours. I miss- I miss her pop-up and I want justice! <laughs> God, why can't Mr. Popple go the way of the fucking... OW! Alright, listen, if you what? ever lose track of me, press down on the button that's on the screen and your chair will focus right on me. That's the connection from the Power Babies. Aw, oh, crap. Well, this is as far as we go. Got Oh shit, look, look above the gate. One, one of these things got a thumbs up on it. Before they were all three, like, red. Oh yeah, I, I see, I see what you're looking at up there. Three buttons. Ooh, that's a lot harder than one button. Jeez, that's three buttons, I don't know. Whoa, holy shit. We got two green thumbs up. One more puzzle somewhere. Try, whoa, well, holy shit, dude. I mean, I can see that puzzle from down here. That, that's insane. That's an insane puzzle. I mean, what the hell? Y you doing all right? Jesus, I don't know. Sh should we check online? I mean, maybe there's a strategy guide online. What the hell were they thinking? What the hell were these? Were the developers thinking with all these buttons? <laughs> it's not fun. This isn't fun. This isn't a good game. Just a bunch of buttons. It's lazy. Fuck this, dude. Come down. C come back down. C f screw this shit. Screw this shit, man. Just calm down. We're not mad. Yeah, you know what? Fuck it. Fuck that puzzle up there. Let's just... We're breaking the door down. Yeah, screw that gate. All right, green power, baby. Mama's gonna get stoned. Hey, excuse me. How's it going? My name's Tony. Oh, I'm Upgrade Tony. I got a real issue over here. If you guys wouldn't mind just uh, checking in with me. I got a real issue right now. Hey, yeah, what's the problem? I got these little ankle biters over here. They're trying to kill me. It's giving me anxiety. Okay, well, what do you want us to do? I want you to kill them. If you kill them, I'll give you this awesome 
Power Baby upgrade that gives you a double jump and a glide. You can glide around with a double jump. It's so much fun. It's the funnest thing you've ever seen. Oh man, I I've always wanted a double jump glide Power Baby upgrade. Yeah, I bet you do. If you kill these ankle biters and leave me amidst all this stress and anxiety I've got and panic attack, then I'll give you this Power Baby upgrade. The upgrade Power Babies are the most powerful ones. Uh, my favorite kind of Power Baby. We gotta take care of this. Yeah, why don't you take care of this stuff? Quit being a fucking stupid little bitch about it. Wow, okay. Hey, you guys did it. You done did it. Come back. Come up to my cool stand. I got an upgrade for you. Oh, thank you guys so much. You guys done did me a huge favor. So here's that awesome power baby upgrade that I promise is going to give you double jump and glide. Oh, man, thanks. Partner, walk me to the stand so I can get the upgrade. Okay, check this out. Watch this. This is crazy. You fucking Ew! You see the shit? He's eating the other ones. Fucking insane. That's what they do when you put them close together. Ew! Isn't that crazy? And all the powers are now in, in, in combined into this one power baby. And here we go. We're ready to double jump, baby. We got the double jump now. What the fuck are you doing? Those are my fucking pets. You just killed my fucking pets. What? What are you talking about? These are the same things you just had us kill in the in the other area to get the, the power baby upgrade. I don't know the difference. Oh, yeah, you don't know the difference because you're a racist piece of shit and everything looks the same to you, huh? Everything's just the same to you. There's no such thing as personalities. You, you think animals don't have spirits? Dude, I don't know what to do. I'm moving out of here. I'm moving to a new area. I'm getting out of here. <laughs> Pet cemetery. Oh, kill all. Oh. Fuck him up, Trevor. Killed my lover. I loved him. Fucking piece of shit. Oh, you fucking cherub. Too easy, man. Zing. You don't get it, Glorcon is cloning us from the oh, fuck their face! Yeah, kill him! Uh, that's it, motherfucker. You zoom! I uh, gotta fucking die now. You guys are fucking dead. Ow! feel bad for these guys I don't oh look who it is Thelma and Louise I hope you guys are happy I just buried my pets that you murdered you fucking monsters I moved up here and created a new life for myself to get away from people like you and here you are I can't be safe anywhere oh fuck oh, oh I'm so sad <laughs> I hope you guys fucking die. Trover and the Cherorpion, you think you're going to be able to defeat Glorcon's minions and clones, but you will never defeat us, and we will stop you and murder you before you're able to even come close to getting to Glorcon, because we are the most powerful clones of Glorcon's. All right, everybody, attack! I'm gonna fuck you up, punk. I'm gonna fuck you up, punk. I'm gonna fuck you up. I'm gonna fuck you up, man. What the fuck? Ow!
Oh, fuck. What the, what the? How am I supposed to get there? Oh god. Dude, uh, uh, what are you gonna do? Yeah. You killed me. Shit, I was supposed to be the best. He told me I would be the one to stop you. No, fuck you. Man, Glorcon's not fucking around sending all those clones after us like that. All right, well, well, we're basically at Michael's house. Let's go. Thank God I don't have to hear that dude cry. Hey, what? Michael, what? come out! Hey, come out here! Knock, knock, hello! What? What do you want, man? This is a private event. I don't give a shit. We're here to push your house over the cliff. Oh, 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 you're pushing this house over. This one right here. Yeah, give me one sec. What the fuck are you doing? What is that? Is that, is that shit? Oh, sorry about that. I guess I forgot the direction my toilet was in. Oh, get the fuck out of here. Get the hell off my property. This is a private event. Look, asshole, we need the Crystal of Ithacles. Mr. Pop-Up said... Mr. Pop-Up? Crystal of Ithacles? Shit, that guy's just pissed because I ate his family. Wait, seriously? That's right. But what Pop-Up needs to realize is that we're all just meat. Their energy is still around. I just ate their meat, okay? Energy never dies. Their flesh can be consumed, but their spiritual energy is still in the cosmos, you fucking assholes. Tell you what, I'll give you my crystal of it, the Cleese, right here. If you knock that boulder over the cliff on a Mr. Pop-Up's house and kill him. Now, if you'll excuse me, what? I'm going to go back inside where I have a, a whole <laughs> mess of pregnant ladies strapped onto the floor where I'm using an intricate network of fluids to inject into their bodies and induce early birth so that I can consume the flesh of their fetuses, okay? Is that okay? <laughs> No, it is not okay. Jesus, another one of these types. Cherubian, turn me facing you so we can talk for a second. All right, listen, I wasn't even supposed to be here. What do you want to do? Do you want to kill Mr. Pop-Up? We, 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 we got to kill somebody. We got to pick one because I want to get the stupid shard of Ithacles and get out of here. Okay, so what, do, what, are, you, what are you thinking? Do you, you want to kill Mr. Pop-Up? No. So... You want to kill Michael then? Okay, yeah, I mean, the guy, this guy, Michael, is talking about injecting fluids into pregnant women and inducing pregnancy and eating the, their babies. I mean, I, I see where you're coming from. Okay, so you want to kill Michael then, yeah? Yes. Yeah, and plus, the fact that he reached into his ass and, and got a ball of shit and threw it in your face. I mean, for God's sakes. Uh, final answer. We kill Michael, yes or no? Yes. Okay, let's kill Michael then. Knocking a house filled with innocent pregnant women right off a cliff. Here we go. Oh, God. Here it goes. What the hell? Knock it off. You're going to kill a bunch of pregnant ladies and ruin my dinner. All right. Hey, you, hey. Oh my god, you guys did it! You killed Michael! Oh my god! You, you guys actually did it! I thought you guys would have just picked one of those crystals up off the ground! It, it seems like the most logical way to way to go about things! What are you talking about? You did it! I didn't know- I didn't think you would have had what it takes! I'm not gonna lie. I'm really sad that Michael's gone, but I've got bigger issues ahead of me. I need to find out where all my pregnant wives are. Here's your crystal of um. Ithacles, you dumb dumb. These are all over the place. I pulled this one out of my ass. My little schmubbler got all rosy. Oh, Jesus Christ. He had that crystal up his ass. 
I don't want that in my I don't want that in my telepod. All right, get the huh? fuck out of here. Go to that special teleportation warp node. That'll warp you back to the telepod you came in. Get the fuck out of my world, you limp leg chair fuck and you stupid suck it head. I missed a pop up and I'm going to beat off thinking about you guys. I gotta tell you, you know, you surprised me back there, Chair Orpian. I didn't think you had what it takes to kill somebody. You know, I thought you were just a baby that needed their hand held. Cannonball! Oh, bye. I gotta tell you, you know, you surprised me back there, Chair Orpian. I didn't think you had what it takes to kill somebody. You know, I thought you were just a baby that needed their hand. Yahoo! I gotta tell you, you know, you surprised me back there, Chair Orpian. I didn't think you had what it takes to kill somebody. You know, I thought you were just a baby that needed their hand held, you know? But I was wrong. You got some grit. <laughs> oh, hey, look, I, I... Yeah, all right! Oh, hey, look, I, I can see Mr. Pop-Up's house right down there. Well, wow, we teleported, we're here. Holy shit! What, th there's crystals everywhere! How do we miss all these? What, did we not notice these before? They're all over the place! Yeah, there's... Alright, I'm plugging the crystal of Ithacles into the telepod! Alright, listen, we're back in the telepod, and the first order of business is let's store some of those green power babies. Alright, so, just rotate around until you see the, the, the big red button. That's... Oh shit, you got enough green power babies to give me a, a a new hit point, a new health point. Oh my god, I'm gonna now I can take more damage. Oh see that's what happens when you collect these green power babies. Alright, okay, we're we're really rocking and rolling. Alright, this is better. This is looking more like it. You know, I don't want you to forget that there's an amazing, awesome unlockable prize if you get all the power babies. I'm just gonna, that's all I'll say about it. Oh shit, you better answer that partner. Trover, chair person, good work. You got the crystal and it looks like Trover's already installed it and upgraded the telepod. Now you just have to teleport to the abstainer's home world, inner sanctum. Very rare opportunity for anyone. Good work guys, uh, we'll talk to you soon. Bye. Jeez, Chair Orpian, I gotta admit, I never saw you, I never thought you had it in you to cold-bloodedly murder somebody like that. Whew, glad I'm not on your bad side. You know, you're gonna do pretty good out here in this cosmos, you know? You're gonna do pretty good when we part ways right after this next part of the game, when we split up, because I'm going my way and you're going your way, and they're not intertangled at all. And that's all I got to say about that. Well, okay. Um, I'm going to teleport to the abstainers. Whilst that's happening. Thank you all so very much for watching. I hope you're finding this as funny as I am. Because it's so not Jesus, disappointing. Where the abstainers live in a giant foggy void. Must be nice. What are you doing? Come see, talk to us. We are the abstainers. We request your presence. We must talk to you in person. We're very interesting to look at. You'll want to see us. Trust me. You'll want to. You'll want to come and be in our presence. It's cool. It looks cool, especially in virtual reality, because you'll you'll be able to look around and feel a, a strong sense of presence, like you're actually here. So come to our inner sanctum and talk to us please we have things to speak with you about we are the abstainers we could talk more about a bunch of inside shit but you know whatever we're the abstainers just come to hang out come and hang out with us let's just chill out what are you doing you're just fucking around oh come my god shut up us. anyway come on let's chill are we anyway <laughs> Thank you all so very much for watching. If you have any suggestions for any videos you want to see, leave it down in the comments down below. I do read them. I may not reply to all of them, but I do certainly read all of them. And I thank you all so very much for watching. 
until the next episode like subscribe and i hope to see you again but anyway though i have been your host mr gage and i will see you in the next video whatever that may well be bye bye